people are hitting two years, which is 24 months. So let me say the list should be around 18 months or 20 months. When we inquire to know what is going on, the information we get is that uh, they don't have any information from the owners, the top. So anything we want to know cannot be related to us. All that we get is that they are working on it. They are working on it. That things will improve. So we should just hold on and things will improve. But if we cease to come to today, that means the end of the company and our monies that we work for will, will not be paid. So we want the company to be in its footing to work. So that's why we come to work and make sure that what we have to do as workers, we do our part. Roughly, the total staff will be 150 plus or something across the country. But right now, our operations are grounded only in the greater Accra region. Management is not cooperating um, to our plight for now because um, information that we need to move us on as a company uh, basically relies on management information. People like Mr. Pratt, who happens to be the board chairman, is not um, showing up. And me, I will say it as it is, because Mr. Pratt, as we expect him to be as a board chairman, to come and talk to we, the staff, is not showing up. So what is he doing as, as a board chairman? That is our question now. They are not paying even SNIT. The second tier and the third tier is hanging since 2013. We pray and hope that SNIT will take this matter up and see um, the, the way forward for these benefits to be paid because it is our money.